Hello YouTube, this is the Florida Rider. Out and about on the scooter again. Yep, I haven't vlogged from the scooter in quite a while and I figured since I'm on it, why not? The motorcycle is actually getting its 16,000 mile servicing as we speak. So, here I am. And I'll even put in a picture of the scooter right here. As an added bonus. So today, I'd like to talk about getting used to different places when you move. As anyone who has moved to a different area or region knows, one of the first things you need to do is to get yourself situated. And by that, I mean finding out what supermarkets are there and other necessities like that. Well, when I first moved to Florida, I was making plans to go ride with someone on Facebook. And they said, yeah, we'll meet at the racetrack at, and he gave me an intersection. I said, okay, no problem. At this point in time, I didn't have a GPS app. I did have my TomTom, -tom, but I wanted a little bit more information, so I looked on Google Maps and I didn't see a racetrack. So I chatted him back and I said to him, are you sure there's a racetrack there? And he said, yeah, it's right near the whatever it is and gave me another landmark. So I got back on Google Maps and I looked again and I chatted him back and said to him, Google Maps does not show a racetrack there. And he said, well, it's there. I was there a few days ago. And I said, well, is it dogs, cars, or horses? And he laughed at that. He said, no, racetrack is a gas station. And I'm like, oh, okay, I see. <laughs> it was an honest mistake because I had never seen a racetrack gas station before. <laughs> so, I'd like to find out if anything similar has happened to you. Has there been a store or some kind of establishment that had a name that could have been taken a completely different way and you mistook it for something else? Please either make a video reply or leave a message in the comments. Get out of my way, you moron. And I'm off for a scoot, so this is the Florida Rider signing off. Goodbye.